السلام علیکم و رحمۃ اللہ وبرکاتہ ایم طالب منشی لیکچر الیکٹرانک کامرس ٹوڈے آئی ایم گوئنگ ٹو ٹیچ یو واٹ از کامرس دین واٹ از ای کامرس واٹ از دا ڈفرینس بٹوین ای کامرس اینڈ ای بزنس اینڈ ٹائپس آف الیکٹرانک کامرس ایڈوانٹیجز اینڈ ڈیس ایڈوانٹیجز آف الیکٹرانک کامرس There are many questions uh, today I am covering. First, see what is commerce. It is division of trade or production which deals with the exchange of goods and services from producer to final consumer. This is commerce. the next different types of electronic commerce uh, in detail we have studied what is electronic commerce electronic commerce is ex uh, transaction with the help of internet with the help of network now see what are the types of electronic commerce there are many types electronic commerce and uh, e-governance like B2B, B2C, B2G, C2C, G2C and G2B. Now see in detail what is first definition. It is commonly known as electronic marketing. It consists of buying and selling of goods and services or an electronic system such as internet. Internet is a whole system electronic system and with this internet if we done buying and selling of goods or services then it is called as electronic commerce other definition it is purchasing selling and exchanging goods and services or computer network or internet through which transactions or terms of sales are performed electronically Now see what's the difference between electronic commerce versus e-business. We use the term e-business to refer primarily to the digital enablement of transaction and processes within a firm involving information systems under the control of the firm. Electronic commerce include commercial transaction. commercial air important commercial transaction involving an exchange of value across organizational boundaries this is process of electronic commerce see here customer sitting is placing order with shopping cart what is this shopping cart this is website like amazon flipkart with the help of some credit card or debit card or uh, other electronic payment system then order is completed here see message is email sent to customer or merchant or business person then order is sent to warehouse for fulfillment then from warehouse to shipping courier then shipping shipment sent to customer this is the whole process of electronic commerce normally done in amazon in our bhivandi area it is bhivandi area is surrounded by many logistics mean godowns the transport is there all over the india transport transport in, in is in bhivandi there are many warehouse so e-commerce we can see practically in bhivandi there are many godowns of amazon flipkart means they are uh, helping us to purchase and to company to sell the products okay the consumer uses web browser you know web browser it is a software with the help of this web browser we can see website to connect to the home page home page of merchants website on the internet home page first page of the website is called as home page the consumer browse means search the catalog catalog of products 
featured on the site and select items to purchase first he search many catalogs like amazon he searching computer mobiles jewelry clothes shoes in any mat uh, any item he can search then add to the cart select items to purchase the selected items are placed in the electronic equivalent of shopping cart when the consumer is ready to complete the purchase of selected items it provides a bill to and ship to address to purchase and delivery now see pro uh, process of electronic commerce again when the credit card number i am continuing it when the credit card number is validated and the order is completed at the commerce server site server site means we are client user is client and server site order uh, on the, their database there is order the merchant site displays a receipt confirming the customer's purchase the commerce the commerce server site then forward the order to a processing network for payment processing and fulfillment fulfillment what is b2b e-commerce b2b e-commerce is simply defined as e-commerce between companies remember this word b2b is between transaction between companies about 80% of e-commerce is of this type mean mostly market is covered by b2b only i explain you edi they uses edi electronic data interchange system here example given intel selling microprocessor to dell the both are company intel company and dell is also company then hens selling ketchup to mcdonalds these are also both companies not not individual consumer see here process of b2b customer it is also business sales wholesaler then wholesaler supplies to business organization order processing with the help of website means wholesaler order and then means all are businesses next b2c com e-commerce b2c means business to consumer e-commerce or commerce between companies and consumer transaction between companies and consumer involves customer gathering information purchasing physical goods or receiving products over an electronic network means dell selling me a laptop means if i am purchasing laptop from amazon flipkart snapdeal any site it is b2c it is b2c because here customer and individual customer orders with the help of website order processing then business organization supplies to customer con consumer this is some some e governance b2g b2g government e commerce is b2g is generally defined as commerce between companies and public sector it refers to the use of internet for public proc procurement licensing pro procedure and other government related operations business pay tax file reports or sales go sale goods and services to government agencies means business are se selling to government agencies this is b2g process B business organization website with the help of website they are selling or they are transacting with government c2c consumer to consumer e-commerce or c2c is simply commerce between private individuals or consumers for example mary mary buying an ipod from tom on ebay or i am selling me selling a car to my neighbor customer one wants to sell product with the help of some website 
customer to want to buy product okay then there is transaction between this consumer and customer with the help of this website like OLX, eBay receives, pro, uh, receives money and re receives product customer to receive product customer one receives money G2C this model is also part of e-governance G2C is e-governance previously I explained you this separate term electronic commerce and e-governance now uh, you can have any question on G2C or uh, so you must remember G2C this model is also part of e-governance this is part of e-governance the objective of this objective of this model is to provide good and effective services to each citizen the government provides the following facilities to the citizens through website means government are providing many facilities to government to sorry to citizens through the website information of all government departments different welfare schemes different application forms to be used by citizens all are example of G2C government with the help of website providing many facilities to citizen G2B Government to business is a business model that refers to government providing services or information to business organization. Government uses B2G model website to approach business organization such website support auction tenders and application submission and functionalities. G2B government with the help of website then transaction between this government and business organization with the help of website is G2B now see some advantages of electronic commerce previously we have learned in very detail some advantages again I am explaining you advantages of e-commerce faster buying selling procedure as well as easy to find products then buying selling all the times 24 by 7 more reach to customers there is no theoretical geographical limitation from anywhere you can purchase uh, products low operational cost and better quality of services no need of physical company setup this is very uh, expensive task to open a physical company but sitting at home also I can do e-commerce business ladies can do also e-commerce business easy to start and manage a business anytime I can start and manage also customers can easily select products from different providers without moving around physically uh, there are many application nowadays on uh, mobile like Misho many uh, many women they are selling the products with the help of this application Misho application this is uh, some advantages of electronic commerce then uh, some disadvantages unable to examine product personally means we cannot touch personally we cannot see that product not everyone is connected to internet uh, uh, in India no not everyone is connected to internet there is possibility of credit card number theft then mechanical failure can cause unpredictable effects on the total process there are, there are uh, some mechanical failures it also cause some trouble okay thank you in this uh, way uh, today we have seen some example of b2g and uh, some e e uh, what are the types of c types of e-commerce e-governance some defi uh, definition of e-commerce then advantages and disadvantages of electronic commerce thank you